the George Washington. Wow. It's a big flat button. That's a Look nice how one. Big it is. Yeah, that's a great find. Whoa. That's a really good find, y'all. <gasps> the point oh, is there. Cute. Man, that's amazing. Okay, ready? <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna get it for you. It's getting bigger. But look, right. this one's all the way up to my knees on this. Got it. That's probably good. The tide's going out. And this is gonna be completely dry, so. Walking through the marsh. Look at this place. Amazing. So we are out here today in the woods, getting ready to do some metal detecting. I have Daisy with me again. Hello. We're gonna search some old house sites today and see what we can find. We got Harley in the background. He's already getting a head start. <laughs> Let's get to it. Showing up about like a bullet, y'all. Let y'all listen to it. Right there. It's in my hand. And it is like a button. We're flat button. Harley has something really good, he said. Yeah. So let's Looks see. Like nice. Bones, <gasps> oh my knife complete out of the oyster shells man that is incredible hand done this is bone and it's lasted that long wow. oh, they, they but it doesn't decompose well right? it does but oh. i'm saying because it's been in the oyster yeah. shells the oyster shell is it. alkaline meaning what? it doesn't you know uh decompose it's, it's really old Dude. that is a great find good job Harley. just to pull that out the shells so i'm about eight alive by mosquitoes but we're finally at this old trash pit, there's oyster shells everywhere. And we're going to dig this out and see what people threw in here. Got to be bottles, buttons, who knows what else. I mean, Harley's already getting it started. And this is like digging through concrete. Like, it's, this is tough, y'all. Making progress. That Annabellum Ware. That's old. That's Civil War period. 1840s, 1850s, 1860s. All right. That's beautiful stuff. We're in a good layer then. Woo. Toss that aside. Keep going. I want to find a spoon. I want to find a, a, a button or a Civil War button or a belt buckle. Jackson, if you're watching this, <laughs> you know what this is like. I brought you out a couple times and we've done the same exact thing, but it's always worth it. Check that out. Big old oyster shell. Oh, wow, that is a trade bead. No, it's not a trade bead. Oh, it's not it's a trade slave bead. bead like, oh, wow, this like, is what they wore. Wow. It's pretty cool. That one don't, actually don't have a hole on the side, so maybe a, like an earring. Yeah, it's like it had a, it went on something. That's cool. That's a good eyeball find. It matches your shirt. I know. Oh, it does have a hole. Yeah, there's a hole. The other side right there. Yep. I bet somebody put that in there. Right and over there, that's a good find. Yes, yeah, so that's a spun one too. That's old. That is amazing. Ready, Ready? set, go. Wow, well, you're doing a great job. Just like that. Just like that. And then I get deeper and deeper. How Just... deep are you going to get? Ready? Don't hurt yourself. You get backlash. <laughs> I can't go further. You're doing a good job, though. Thanks. If you keep up that rate, we might have a hole. Right. Hey, let's detect. So we interrupt today's amazing metal detecting adventure to bring you a special announcement. The Nugget Noggin Live metal detecting event is this May 6th in Rock Hill, South Carolina, and I want to invite you out to join us. Daisy's going to be there with me. Yeah. We have thousands of silver coins we're burying in the ground, and epic prizes to win. GoPro cameras, gold coins, 10 ounce silver bars. We're giving away metal detectors, over a dozen metal detectors, pinpointers, shovels, some awesome stuff. So it's going to be a blast. You can click the link in the video description below or go to nuggetnoggin.com forward slash event to get signed up today. You got about 27 days left. Grab your tickets y'all. Uh, I'm taking a break while Daisy's digging for me. When you find us something good, we'll share it. You ready? Mm hmm. Man. Ugh. Hard work, y'all. This is no joke out here. Gotta be 
almost crazy to handle the mosquitoes and <laughs> the weather. Mosquitoes aren't even bothering you. They're not even around you. Yeah, because I sprayed my whole body with like a whole bottle where I was dripping mosquito spray. Mm. Oh, that's, oh, that's the cool. Handle to the, uh, the pot. The stove. Like frying pan. Yeah, frying pan. Cool. It broke off. Got too hot or cold and shattered. We are out here in the swamp today. Yeah. Look, I mean, but seriously, there's something okay. right here. What is it? I don't know what that is, though. A Turner thingy. Oh, right. Mr. Turner. Is that what that is? It's something that, uh, 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 yeah, looks like it turned. Maybe it, it uh, yeah. What if it, like, this it has a food something. on it and a fire and they spun the fire? Hey, it's definitely something old. That's handmade right there. That's a, that's wow. a big old piece of iron. A good I fun. want to keep it. You can keep it. You're welcome to have it. Yeah, look. Oh shoot. Well, you right, got something good? Go ahead and show us what hold you on, found, Mr. Know It All. Hold on. Let me get up. Expert is what I like to be referred to as. Well, I got it. <laughs> Here we go. All right. <gasps> it's an eagle button. Oh, Civil oh. War There's button. Eagle right there. Yeah, sure is. But it yeah. came apart. Well, it's old. Yeah. Well, the dirt was already in it, so it'd been like that. But yeah, it's the. That is nice. Nice. Ooh. Oh, yeah, button. you can see the eagle on that one side, yep. right there. Look, I found a Turner thingy. What is it? I don't know. Do you know? Is it a meat grinder? I don't know. It turns things. Look at this little bitty baby cauldron. Oh, there you go. How cool. Another bottle. Dispens dispensary? Another yeah. dispensary bottle. We're finding tons of broken dispensary bottles. Gosh, this would be so stinking cute if it was full. It's a high tone. Real good signal. I see it. Umbrella piece. <laughs> Why did that give such a high signal? I think it's going to be a two piece. four hole. Oh, or it's a, coin. a penny. You know, it might be a button. I thought it had holes in it. Oh, it's, it's, if it's a penny, it's an Indian head. Or a wheat penny. It better not be a wheat penny out here. No, that's too low for a wheat penny if you think about it. It had to be a 71. I think it's a flat button. There's a shank right there. Oh, yeah, it's a flat button. Right there. It's a little flat button. Is that a flat button for real? Yeah. Is that one. a little bitty baby button? A yep, flat. a baby button. Oh my gosh, I got a little bitty baby button. Is there anything on it? No. Oh, let me see. It's cute. She said she found a snake, y'all. Let's go see what the snake looks like. Look at it. I see it. I'll come get you. Can you want to pick it up? Do not touch it. That's He's a, not uh, a venomous one. He's got a round head. He's a, a friendly it's snake. It's a water snake. He's friendly. Hey, buddy. Here he goes. I won't bother you today. Wow. Look at this snake. And I just got a flat button. You want to see? Yeah, look at him. He's just going. I found the flat button right beside him. Look how long he is. See? You found an armadillo. I found a dead armadillo carcass, and this oh. was right beside it. That's a nice one. Yeah, that's a nice button. Might have a design on it. Okay, you ready? It's something good. I'm ready. Dig it up. It's not deep though, which kind of scares me a little bit. Might be aluminum. Shot it pretty big. Oh, Shouldn't be see. no aluminum out here. Okay. All right. I'm gonna dig uh, it out some more. Never mind. Something big. I thought it was gonna be something good. That might be a big piece of brass. You got it. Kay. It's going to be something good. <gasps> what is it? It is nothing. It's a piece of lead. <laughs> is that what that is? I want to see it. It's a good find. It's a shark tooth. I don't know. A piece of lead. Sounded good. Oh, man. It's got to be an eagle. Yeah, it's definitely got to be. Oh, yeah, it's an eagle. I see the shield on there. Do you? I'm pretty sure it's an eagle. Let me see it real quick. Oh, look at the shank. I don't know. It, it's going to have to be cleaned up, but it could be a South Carolina. Hard to tell what's on there, but it's definitely a two-piece button, so that's a military button. That's a great find. Good job. Thank you. This is a really good signal right there. Okay, it's like 79, 80 blowing my ears out. Oh, it might be big. I just hit something hard. No, that's a root. Oh. Dig around it. Dig a big hole. Hey. Okay. Oh, it's got a good signal. I okay, dug my button here. right here. That's, that's a good signal. It's going to be a big brass object. Being that uh, solid of a hit. Okay. Oh, there's an oyster there too. Let's see I'm where scared. it's at. 
scared. What are you scared of? Ooh. Look at that old <gasps> lock plate. Look at that big old button. <gasps> Could be George Washington. Wow. It's a big flat button. That's a Look nice how one. Big it is. Yeah, that's yeah. a great fun. I got it. That's probably not my biggest flat that's button. A I've ever yeah, it's a 1700s dandy button. 1700s button. A big old, big old coat. Could have, have GW. That oh, it's might got have really good. It though. might have GW. It's almost big enough. And if it had GW. Why would it up so high? No, I don't, I don't see anything yet, but man, that's a, it's a big button, y'all. button. Hard to lose something that big. How exciting! It's a great sight. All right, let's Yay. keep digging. <laughs> Still in the plug. Oh, it's awful round. Might be a seed of dime. It could be. It's definitely dime, or... We've only been here a few minutes at this new site. It's wow. silver. Ooh, that's really good. I don't know what that is. Oh, that's going to be a good one, man. Just a little bit. <laughs> I'm trying to do more. a little bit. There we go. Ooh, it's worn. Ooh, I'm seeing something. That's what I'm thinking. It's seated. I think it's seated, It's yeah. just worn. Yeah. Great find. It's a silver coin. Yeah, you can see yep. the date right there, but... It's 86 oh, or 66. Oh, I see it. Yeah, it looks like it might wow. be an 8 or a 6. Job, yeah, Holly. seated dime. That's right. a great That's awesome. great find. We've only been here a few minutes. And I got a signal I'm trying to dig. Daisy's trying to dig a signal. Man, there's signals everywhere. There is. We haven't even got to the site Dude. yet. Found <laughs> a spoon, y'all. Pretty shallow. It's about an inch deep. Gave like a pull tab signal. In the late 1800s, early 1900s there. All right, so I just dug this up. Huge signal. I think it's going to be something good. Oh, it's decorative. Man, this is a good find. That looks like a bird's head or something. Uh -oh. oh, this might go on the end of a cane or I don't know what this is for. This is, yeah, it's like the end of a, it's a handle off something. Uh, I don't know if it's a, not a sword, but this is a good find. Whoa. Pretty cool. That's insane. <laughs> I don't know it's what It's really that is. cool. That's crazy. That's cool. I mean, it might not be anything that's war old period, too. but yeah, that's it, good. It, it's, it's something cool. That's awesome. That's a really good find, y'all. <laughs> yeah, I first thought it was a, part to a sword guard. Well, yeah. But it's too heavy. It's really heavy. <laughs> that's solid brass. That's wow. kind of expensive. So I just got a good signal down here, y'all, and take a look at what it is. It's a good find. There it is. That's the Indian head penny. You can barely make out the head on there. This one's probably going to have a date, too. It's in good shape. But. Oh, there's gonna be another flat button. Nice Indian head. Woo, mosquito on me. 18 something. All right, y'all, so I just found this thing. Oh, a, this is the end of a what? That's the end of a sword. Oh, that's where the sword goes in? That's where yeah, the, the base goes in, the handle. The handle goes in there, yeah. And they had wood in between. Oh. Yep, that's the base <sighs> off a sword. I found them before at, at uh, Civil War sites. Well, I've never found one before. That's a great, no, I'm saying it's a good, it's a good find. Thanks. It's a real good find. It looks like it has a design on it. Ooh, we'll yeah. have to look and see. Yep, it has a design. You'll be able to clean it up. That's the end of a sword, the cap. Oh, yeah. That's a that's a great find. Thanks. I'm not going to find the rest of it. Dude. Leaving Dude. the island. And then we're up to our knees in water. Wow. We're going to get out to the boat. Could easily be a gator out here. Oh, yeah. my God. It's getting a lot deeper, y'all. And something just moved over by the boat. They could be hiding in this darkness. There's nothing in here. There's nothing in here. Go wherever the boat is, because it's shallow. I don't know if it's shallow. Um, it's going to get a little bit over your waist, okay? Those. All right, so we are in gator territory, literally up to our waist. Yep. Look at me, I'm soaking wet. In water, and the boat obviously has a hole in it too. And I had to go out there, pretty much in the river, and pull this boat in so we can make it back. And it's fluff mud central here. There's definitely gators out. It's nighttime. I mean, we are literally in a gator infested area, standing up past my knees in water. We got the bucket for a reason. Water out of here. So we are back in from digging, y'all. These are all the finds. We had an amazing day. 
Look at all this stuff. Got a good variety. Everyone found something. Whether it was buttons, silver, or relics. So we'll start off with Harley's finds. Harley got all kinds of stuff. Let's see, this is candle holder from the trash pit. The base of the candle holder. Uh, this is off a sword here. Look at that. Like for the uh, handguard. I guess that's what it's called. Harmonica reads a heart locket. It's really cool. I guess that's off a pocket watch there. Something like that. Uh, feather edge pottery. Flat buttons. Really old 1700s pewter button right here. It's got a nice design on it. Uh, suspender clip buckle from Civil War. Some Civil War bullets there. It's probably Confederate. And this looks like it could be a... Well, might be a three-ringer now, but I thought it was a gardener. It's hard to tell. It's dirty. And it still might be. Nice sword hanger. Beautiful knife. Check that out. I was found in that oyster shell pit. Thimbles. Oh, Indian head, 1907. And then I think the best find in here, at least the best coin find, is a seated dime. So 1886 is what it looks like. Seated dime. It's a great find. And we'll go to Daisy's finds. Daisy made a really great discovery. This is a sword pommel, the end of a sword, and on the handle, at the cap. Look at that. You can see a design on there. That is Civil War or older, but probably 1850s. So that is amazing. Real good find. Uh, we're not sure what this thing is. Hey, if y'all know, comment below. Looks like some type of fuse or something to a BOMB. -B. So you got a beautiful flat button. Check this out. This is a dandy button, you know, late 1700s, maybe 1800s. And I think it has some writing on the back that says guilt. So probably best guilt. So at one time this was plated to probably look nice and shiny. Back to a pocket watch, some lead, maybe a piece of like a music box, alarm clock thing. Another flat button here. She got a train button. You can see a caboose or some type of train on there. So that's pretty cool. Brass nail, some type of digging hoe. We're not sure what this is. It's a turning thing off of some type of piece of equipment, heavy duty. But it was in the oyster pit. Yeah, so they threw it in there. So maybe farm related, who knows. And these are my finds. Had a few good things, some nice buttons. Got an 1891 Indian head penny. That's what it turned out to be, and that's pretty good. 1800s coin. Real nice uh, colonial buckle here. Uh, I got a few bullets. These are infield bullets from Civil War. A dresser drawer handle, a spoon. Gotta love finding them. A little horse um, bridle strap piece. Maybe like a reins guide or the uh, strap went through there. And that's Confederate too. It's found with these bullets. Big old buckle, which could be, well, it looks like a buckle. Could be period. And then this thing I think is the best find because it's the most unique. This is a really cool, some type of bird. That is awesome. Like solid brass. That's heavy duty. So if y'all know what this is, give me your best guess. Comment below. And maybe somebody will figure it out. It looks old. That's definitely maybe 200 years old. It's a phoenix or an eagle or some type of bird on there. Uh, maybe off a cane is what I'm thinking. Off the top of a cane or but definitely a, a handle. So, wow. Somebody had a lot of money, didn't they? That was a lot to lose back then. So that's pretty much it, y'all. I'll also got this button right here. This is a, it has an eagle on it and some marine button. You can barely make it out, two piece. So that's a really good find. We hope y'all enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Y'all make sure to hit this like button. Subscribe if you haven't already and click the bell so you can get notified every time I upload another one. All right, y'all, so I was just kicking back the clam shells, oysters, whatever they're called, and I found a piece of a knife. Look. That's a great find. Literally was just kicking them back and it just popped out. How cool. It's the whole knife, just missing the handle. That's where it was right there on the bottom and the tip of the tip of it. Here we go. Great find. Yay. Look at this, y'all. 
Do you do you see it? Yeah, I see it. Look. Can you see it? Look what right I just found. There. <gasps> the oh, point is there. Cute. Man, that's amazing. Dude. Look at that. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh. What a my bug. gosh. Like, what are the odds of that? That is in. Look how perfect it is. Oh man, that is. Yeah, Crazy. the natives are here too. What's it made out of? Coral or rock? No, cor uh, um, chert. Wow, Coastal chert yeah. from Savannah River. That is beautiful. Dude, what a find. That is, That's the best one I've seen in a long time. That is a good one. Got another good signal showing up in the 50s. It's going to be something good. Man, can it be another gold Esquato? <laughs> Second one of the day if it is. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Hold on. Uh oh. It's right. Oh, I see it. It's right at the tip. It's shiny. It's gonna be Sounds a flat button. Good. It's gonna be a flat button. All right. I see it. It's a button. <gasps> oh. It's a beautiful one too. It's got a design on the front. It's a, oh, it's got the shank on the back. Oh yeah, it's beautiful condition. Just emerald green, what you want to see. Is it a two piece? No. No, it's a beautiful design with a star on the front. Wow. You ready? <gasps> Look at that beautiful. Oh man, that is beautiful. Look That's at insane. that, y'all. Look at that's, the back. That's a beautiful button. Perfect. That'll Man. clean up brand. I know. New. Let's, let's get a close up of this. That, yeah. That is a great. Look at that. Somebody missed that, y'all. We can't. This place is about to be destroyed, too. That is beautiful. Ooh, look at this pottery. No, that's think... mocha ware. Oh, that is. Oh, that is so 1760s. Great. Man. They call that mocha ware. Look, look how they smeared it with their finger. That is amazing. This is a 1700 site. Yep. Wow. This button right here is really nice, though. I Seriously. Know, it that, is. That's. that's that's a high dollar button there. Nice. We had a stranger show up. Dennis, right? That's right. <laughs> and check out what he found. My second pair of cufflinks. Oh man, I'm not sure the date beautiful. period on them, but they're like a pewter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They got like a, I don't know if you can see a little glass, glass top to them. Beautiful. Yeah, I got to zoom in on that. Like, that is awesome. That's a, man, look at the detail. That's a great find, man. Yeah, that link, I can't believe the link on that, the detail on that. Heck yeah. Towards the end of the day, too, and we're yeah. out here on a site. Like, here. Yeah, he's got something good. You gotta check it out. Fighting the bugs. Tough links. They time got a period. maker's mark in the middle, too. Oh, really? The time period for the. Right there, the, the glass and them like that. It's Peter. 1750s, 60s, <gasps> 80s. Ooh. <laughs> That's amazing. That's uh, probably like oyster shell. Sh uh, I bet it is, since they ate so many. We are wrapping it up. This is what we got from one site. Say we did pretty good. So I guess we'll start with my finds. Got a few, few buttons there. This one says uh, "Guilt" on the back. Little design on there. I thought there was something on the front, but looks like it's just been hit. Another little flat button. Nothing on the front of that one. Another ball button, which is cool. Piece to a spoon handle. That's what it looks like. Pewter. I'm not sure what this thing is, but I'm sure y'all will know. So if you do. Comment below and let me know what you think. Harley got a pile of pottery <laughs> <laughs> and some nice, nice buttons there. I like that one. Yeah. Reef on it. Um, you get more decorative buttons, tom back buttons. Oh, I know. I got some other stuff in my pocket. I got more finds. <laughs> well, over. I, I found the other piece of that. That's what reminded me. <laughs> See that right there? That's off a dresser. Um, he got another. That's his second arrowhead right there. The first one's in the truck. Got stuff right. <laughs> Look at that. I'm just holding out. <laughs> uh, buckle. Piece of like a dresser, I guess. And stuff. And yeah, there might be some more, but this is pretty cool. So, Look at the design. You know that was hand carved, more than likely. Um, clay pipe stems. Almost a complete pipe bowl right there. What is this? I don't know. Like some kind of... Watch winding key piece? Yeah, it could key, be. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I think that's what that is. But yeah, ring, big dandy button right there, ball button. Good stuff. All right. And Dennis, he came just for the last hour, and look what he found. <laughs> <laughs> Some nice cuff links. That link is crazy the way that's made. I love that. Yeah, let's get a, let's get a close up. There you go. That Yeah, that's a cool little link in between there. You can see. Should have some markings on it, you'd think. Yeah, there'd be a hallmark on it. And then uh nice nice button there. So a little horse buckle and some I guess pewter there. But yeah, those cuff links are beautiful. Yeah, that was worth coming out here for that. They're definitely worth it. Yeah. Worth the whole trip. So I'd say we had a good day. 
We all got some great finds. So this is our campground for tonight. Friends letting us stay. See, we have our shower rig. Check that out. I hooked <laughs> up the hose and in here and, you know, wash your hair, get the bugs <laughs> off. We got concrete floors. Nice and luxury. Soft. <laughs> this is like staying in the Hampton Inn. It better. Yeah. This is the view we have from camping tonight. Bright moon. Those some beautiful longleaf ponds. I know. Got the tent set up. Take a look at this. Look at the inside here. So this is the master bedroom. Soft bed right there. Beautiful sheets. Fresh and clean. Slept pretty good out here last night. It did get a little bit cold, but at least the bugs stayed off of me. And hey, I'm ready to get out and do it again. Do some metal detecting today. It's going to be good. Sun's coming up, y'all. Time to go get the relics. Look at that. Look at all those bites. Look, like, I don't know if that's gnats. Are those gnats? Or yeah, Obviously, gnats. some are mosquitoes, but <laughs> just one arm. I just washed them off, and I had so much dirt on my arms, I couldn't see all these bites. That's literally hundreds. <laughs> that is terrible. Mosquito got me. That's just one mosquito. <laughs> that's bad. 